Is it okay to ask, I don't understand whether it would be a good or bad thing to leave the EU? Hashtag confused. Well, for a start, that's not a question. <laughs> so it's not okay to ask that because... <laughs> Because that's a statement. Yeah, that's a good is point. it okay to ask that? No. <laughs> and he's misspelt weather, so yeah. it's not going. To... All right, we're going to have to simplify this. <laughs> okay, here we go. Are you ready? We're going to simplify the whole thing. This is David Cameron. <laughs> he's the British Prime Minister. He's the one in the jumper. <laughs> David Cameron wants Britain to remain part of the European Union with Germany, <laughs> France, and wherever this guy is from. <laughs> uh, a lot of British people feel they're being treated unfairly by the EU and, and preferred it when Britain's relationship to Europe was like this. <laughs> We feel nostalgic. <laughs> <laughs> so David Cameron wants us to vote on the subject. But first, oh, we just thought that was good. Uh, <laughs> but first, he went to all the EU members and asked if we could be treated a little bit better. <laughs> the German Prime Minister wants us to stay. <laughs> Nigel Farage wants us to leave. <laughs> <laughs> and Boris Johnson is still deciding which way to swing. <laughs> He's the mayor of London. <laughs> Lads, how do we feel about all this? Well, I'm more confused now. <laughs> so can otters vote? Otter, otters can't vote. That was just a funny photo. Oh, we found. sorry, I'm completely lost. Um, That's there because we couldn't find a monkey, to be perfectly honest. <laughs> um, I, I, I feel um, about the EU. Yeah. Bored. Um, I don't know. I don't, I, don't, I don't understand it. None of us understand it. Why? I don't understand why you're bringing something no one understands to a referendum. You might right. as well just have a bomb disposal expert and we vote, is it the red or the blue wire? <laughs> <laughs> and, and the problem is, I think they can get away with anything, cos I've never read an article about the EU beyond the first paragraph without drifting off. I don't know any... Of for all I know, paragraph two is, did you know they wear rabbits as mittens? <laughs> <laughs> no offence. And, um... <laughs> You've got a rabbit, haven't you? <laughs> no, I'm... <laughs> uh, well, I'm a little bit quirky at weekends. <laughs> <laughs> uh, do, you know, do you know the worst thing about that? I count this as the weekend, and I'm worried. <laughs> what, what do you make of it all, Alex? Do you know what? I've given it a lot of thought this week, yep. and the way I see it, I'm quite torn on it, because, on the one hand, they've just suddenly, you know, all the data roaming charges in the EU, They've gone down now, yeah. and it's now, you know, cheaper than ever to tell people on Facebook you're having a great holiday and brag. Yeah. But then, on the other hand, how many times have they screwed us over in Eurovision? Air, like... <laughs> like, Blue, in 2011, entered Eurovision. They came 11th. I'm sorry, but I just washed my hands of it after that. <laughs> how are you allowed to do the hand jokes, but I'm not? That's... <laughs> It's just a normal... Oh, oh. sorry, I washed my little hands of it. <laughs> there we go. It kind of comes down to which celebrity convinces you the most, doesn't it? Yeah. Because Michael Caine says we should get out, uh, actress Emma Thompson says we should stay in, but also describe Britain as, quote, a cake-filled, misery-laden, grey old island, uh, <laughs> which turned half of England against her but made her a hero in Australia. <laughs> but, but Michael Caine wants to leave because he's worried Italy are going to find out he stole all that gold. <laughs> <laughs> That was a slow uh, response, wasn't it? <laughs> Started with nothing, ended up with a round of applause. What was that? I was going to say, that was a lot funnier. I'd leave it. Carry on. OK. <laughs> Football may also be affected, as EU players would need special dispensation for contracts, uh, which means Arsenal 2, Leicester 1 could be a tally of the number of players left on each team. <laughs> and, look, I'm not sure how I feel about all this, cos, you know, on the one hand, I understand Britain wants to go off on its own, but I do think it would probably affect the EU. And, you know, as an Australian, I mean, I can't imagine what would happen if New Zealand ever wanted to become independent from us. <laughs> <laughs> Scum with the feather, then. <laughs> I said glitter after that joke. <laughs> glitter, <laughs> People at home haven't seen that, and it now looks like we're all having a breakdown. <laughs> what you do is you hold your cursor over the trumpet, 
You move it around, Donald watches it go around, and when you're ready, you do this. <laughs> I mean, it never... And occasionally, 